A nationwide effort to prevent school violence is making an impact here in the east. This week, schools in the Swansboro area have been taking part in activities to promote school safety. It's all part of the Say Something Week. Not in your size, Camila Barco joins us now to explain how the movement is sparking conversation. Camila. Right, Ken and Shayla, Say Something Week is comprised of a series of events in which students learn how to recognize the sus suspicious activity and report it to an adult. Organizers hope it will encourage students to speak up if they see the warning signs of a dangerous situation. Okay, so here we go. Students at Swansboro High School marched for School Safety Friday. Kind of a way to unite as one and show everybody that we're here for each other. We can kind of create like a microcosm of positivity throughout our campus. It's part of a movement through Students Against Violence Everywhere and Sandy Hook Promise. We want um, people to know that they can reach out to a trusted adult, whether in the school or a parent. Say Something Week is comprised of a series of events that encourage students to say something if they see something. Students have participated in activities like wearing name tags to spark a conversation or creating a mural of handprints to pledge to the prevention of violence in schools. Look for warning signs, signals, and threats. Act immediately, take it seriously, and say something to your trusted adult. It ends with a meeting of all Swansboro schools at adjoining fences. Students wave to each other as a signal that they are here for each other. Try to be an advocate, advocate to the little kids and showing them like what you could be and like striving for something bigger than yourself. The goal is for students of all ages to be able to notice when someone can harm themselves or other people. And it's basically just uniting as a community to say we don't really agree with bullying. We don't want you to hurt each other. We don't want bullying in our community. And while it is a small change within the county, these students are hopeful they can create bigger change in the future. This is the first year Swansboro schools have participated in this event. They plan to continue this in the coming years. Live in Jacksonville, Camila Barco, Nine on Your Side.